Hello crazy ones out there, I am Rani Castadora and welcome to a new video. First of everything else, I want to say thank you to everyone who are subscribing this channel we right have now. We made it, we have done it and you are amazing, the crazy ones out there, you are and If you watch this video without subscription, make sure to leave a subscription down here, the subscription button will say a subscription, you will not lose any video, you will see everything what's happened behind the scenes, in front of the scenes, and if you want to know more about my life, if you want to see more behind the scenes, make sure to follow me on Instagram, it's the same as here, Bronica Sedora, and if you want some, had some questions you want to ask me, uh, make sure to send me a DM, I will answer it, I promise I will answer every question. Let's not talk much, let's go straight. So, a lot of people ask me who are your idols, who are the persons or the people that you look up to, the persons that you idolize for your life and I brought some of them with me today and we will talk about it and I will leave my favorite one to the last so make sure you watch this video to the very last so the minute. the first and one that we have to talk about is Christina Aguilera. I love her voice. She is such an inspiration for younger generation and she was my idol and one of the idols that I look up to when I was younger. I looked up to a lot of different, um, different characters, different actresses, different singers and Christina Aguilera was definitely and you guys, one of if them. If you guys have watched my two vlogs that I have um, recorded with my band you know that I am a singer I'm not a professional I am a singer for passion it's a hobby and um, as you guys can see I I'm trying to know to do a little bit what Aguilera does. She is incredible with all those uh, voice techniques. And she taught me how to hit the notes out. She I looked up her and she was the one who I and tried not to do this. every musician nowadays has the possibility or the capability to do those things. That's why Christina Aguilera has a big damn place in my heart and I love her. The next one is the one that Christina Aguilera has actually done um, a featuring that is Demi Lovato. Demi Lovato is one of my idols. She started just like other idols that I have on Disney. Uh, she had to struggle with things when she was very very young uh, different personalities and there's even a doc documentary on YouTube about uh, her story starting from the button till now who is uh, called Simply Complicated. You guys know that nowadays being an idol or being something that you kind of carrying a franchise and you kind of carrying it an image with you and it's not always that that easy to to take that, that oh, image with you live different lives because Disney had put a very a franchise on her and she had to carry that franchise that image that idol and like she said she wasn't ready for being that, that, that she was very young she was I think she was 17, 18 when she started on Camp But Rock. she always had been honest with her audience. She always had been honest with her public. It doesn't matter if it's juvenile public, uh, adult public. She always had uh, the honesty in front of the cameras. And that's one of the things that a lot of artists nowadays and don't. She was doing a recovery um, program for not... Um, consuming alcohol. And there was Rock in Rio last year in Portugal. And she was an invitation, she, she has to perform that. And she released a song uh, called Sober. And the song was so honestly, and she apologized to her mom, her dad, that she's not sober anymore, and that she feels guilty for it, and that she is a human, and she has the right to do mistakes. If you're hearing that, that music video, you kind of get, you know, it's, it's unbelievable and she is she had wrote that song so honestly and you can feel it in a way of doing that that she is saying to the world hey, I know I am a 
famous person, but I am human too, I do mistakes too, I do things that I don't have to, and that's so, you know, that cat's got you, you know, and that's why Demi Lovato is definitely one of my Next nice. one is Elatina, and she is the same age as I am, and I start seeing her music video clips uh, a long time ago when she was uh, doing a cover from Jenny from the Block and transform it to Becky G from the Block. Of course, I'm talking about Becky G. Becky G actual name is Rebecca Gomez. She is an American Mexican citizen. She her family is all from Mexico, uh, but she had been born and grow in Inglewood. It's a city in uh, the United she States. She had those the characteristic of transforming at that moment um, big uh, hits that were hits at that moment. Uh, Kanye West. Um, J-Lo, Jenny from the block and she transformed it to her own songs and make kind of a rap thing from it and it was something new that was on the market and I loved it. I, I actually my whatsapp status is one of her status is that I won't stop till I get to the top because I'm still I'm still Becky G from the block it's it's incredible made and I love this song it, till now and she had grown so much she's starting she, with American music with English speaking music and then she she finds herself in the Latin music and in my opinion it fits so much better to her and she she always uh, also said that that she was kind of getting lost in, in that American style music and she found herself in the Latin music and she always did fan that you are equal and she is one of my you know raising stars I mean her uh, hit song called so, Mayores. So proud of Rebecca Gomez uh, actually Becky G um, I followed her since I'm you know, we're basically the same age. I followed her since she started there. And all those romances she had with Austin Mahone and now she's dating a football player. It's it's incredible. I love her and I'm following her everything I can. Her last video called Little Black Dress. Oh my gosh, it's so incredible. She mixed it American with Spanish and turned it into Spanglish. It's it's incredible. And last but not the least is my uh, most amazing idol that is Selena Gomez. Crazy. Selena Gomez, my my idol since I'm a kid, my my inspiration to my dailies, my inspiration in so many things in life. Um, like I said, she has a song called Who Says? And this song means so, so, so damn much to me because who says that I wouldn't make it on YouTube? Who says I wouldn't make it on my life? And she has such an inspiration for me. She always had, like Demi Lovato and like the other ones, she always stood true to her audience, true to her public. She never had faked. She or is such an inspiration, and I am watching her since she started on Barney. Very young, very little, and then she became. She was actually rejected from Disney Channel twice when she was younger, and Disney Channel does not believe in her at the beginning uh, that she had potential to to grow uh, on Disney Channel. But then and um, she proved herself getting the role uh, as Alex, uh, Alex Russo in the Wizard of Waverly Place, and. I'm a fan of her every Selenados, we true Selenados who have been with you through your ups, through your downs, through everything that you went on in life. We are with you, Selena. We so crazy ones up there. This is the end of this video. And coming to the end of this video without subscription, I mean please, you've got to subscribe. Subscribe. I will appear in a few seconds here, a, a circle who says subscription, you have to click on my uh, face. Who says subscription, or here, down here is the red button who says subscription. You will see every video that will uh, appear on this channel, you will not lose any video. And if you want to see what's happening behind of the cameras, if you want to see more about my daily life, Instagram, Instagram is today's most... Um, it's the social media that everyone has. Everyone has an account. So make sure you follow me on Instagram. If you have some questions about everything uh, or anything, uh, make sure to or leave it on the comment section below or write me a DM oh, on Instagram. And answer it. I will read every question, every comment, doesn't matter. I will 
I promise you I will read it and we'll see each other in the next video and au revoir.